Well, the Yukon Huskies are the 2014 NAACP national champs. Wilson, you want to co-host with me? We brought grapes. Here, here, here you go. Oh, look, look what here. I got. There's a grape. Oh, I'll, I'll take that. And oh. 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 Sorry, I didn't mean to grape. tease you. I didn't mean to tease you. I'm I sorry. I think you just got told by a monkey. I did. We zijn hier in Kampen, een van de drie prachtige historische Hansenstede in de IJsseldelta. Want hier wordt binnenkort het grootste paasevenement van Nederland georganiseerd. Seel Kampen. Burgemeester, wat is er nou zo bijzonder aan Seel Kampen? Als je de mooiste opvullen. Oh. 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 Dat, 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 dat gaat niet goed. Deze kant op. Nee. Probeer. Те, кто посмелее, соревнуются в ловкости. Например, перепрыгивают эту лужу. Но не всех это получается. Szép számmal érkeznek a további üzenetek, idős Balázs Lajosnak születésnapja alkalmából Dinner outside. Oh, wait a second. Oh. He can't do that up here. They can be up here, but that, okay. That I put the dance you you got to stop that, Mara. <laughs> All right, let's go to this. <laughs> Speaking of babies, we want to congratulate. Channel 10 photo journalist Joe Baker and his wife, Colby, on the birth of their daughter. How about it? Oh, Stella. look, she's beautiful. Good golly, look at her. She was born yesterday, weighing in at 8 pounds, 12 ounces. This is some action going up on in here. And congratulations, Joe, and we're so excited for you. We will announce the third rabbit's name in nine months. <laughs> uh, about two to four inches of rainfall in the, sh can in the county shaded in green here. Yeah, it, yeah. It, whoa, 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 jeez. I'm sorry about that. The wind just blew me over. We're going to throw it back to you guys. All right, save the, the shake. Studio. Save the chocolate shake. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, Rick Mecklenburg. Three after seven. Here's... Oh, sorry. Okay, that was scary. That was right. <laughs> We had a light pop, and that was not <laughs> no, that pretending was not. or being dramatic. <laughs> oh, no, my God. Like, at, least, <laughs> at least you handled it well. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> we had a light pop. <laughs> you I wasn't even ready for the that. The thing is, it's like, was... it popped, he yelled, and then grabbed his heart. <laughs> and it looks like we might have some snow that day. Oh. No way. I know. That's April 7th. I know. Sorry. Worst winter ever. Rena's gone. <laughs> Worst winter ever. <laughs> Take your hand. Okay. Wave it over the key. Oh! Jesus. <laughs> oh, goodness. Oh. oh, my goodness. That's, that's, oh. You, you have the key, though. You do have the key still? Oh, my goodness. That's, oh, sorry. That happens. It, Chief Correspondent Jay Levine is live at the restaurant in River North, where the president is expected to raise big bucks for the DNC. Jay. About a million dollars by our calculations, Kate, at two events here in Chicago. The first at Chicago. Obama, Obama is a war criminal and a horror. There is some protesters going on here that were, uh, ooh, just as we are talking. But let's get back to what's really here tonight. Safety, as you know, is paramount. <laughs> Performer Miley Cyrus dropped yet another bombshell. We are not happy campers. Except this one happened before she even took the stage. I'm a little upset. My birthday's on Friday. This was for my birthday. But the utter shock brought fans like Ashley Shelton <laughs> to tears. I really wanted to see her really bad. Oh, you're going to shoot us? You might shoot us. Do you guys want to talk to us now? Why not? Well, why are you stopping then? Don't even think about throwing that on me. Come here. You white people, 
Okay, so once again, the squatters are right here. They're about to leave the establishment. Just so you guys know, you're live on television. I wouldn't do that. So as you can see, they're not the uh, nicest neighbors that you want to live next to. We'll show you how firefighters are having to deal with that coming up at six. Thanks for joining us. Nightly News is next. I'm praying for my life. And then the smoke got me. I got bronchitis. Ain't nobody got time for that.